Hello all, Havoc here. Alright, so, in this episode, we're gonna go walkabout. We're prepping up for a, at the end of the last episode, and uh, I think we're gonna do that this episode. Uh, we're gonna give a minute for some of the terrain to load, it looks like. Fantastic. And uh, we're gonna head, I think it's that way, because I think it keeps seeing a satellite dish up there, and I want to get a second one set up. So, comments from last episode were that we can build an electric furnace now, which... As soon as I saw the update from last episode, I thought about that as well. So what we're going to do is we're going to run up here while we're waiting for some terrain to load. And we're going to look at some of the components that might be necessary for doing that. Maybe. There we go. So we should need some insulated pipe. And then we need uh, electric pipe heaters. So let's go to hydraulic... You're not plugged in. <sighs> How much time do I have till the sun comes up? We got a minute. So let's do this. Why am I doing it this way? There's a method to the madness. Uh, cutters, cable. We might split out like pretty quick and run. Because my goal is to get underway. Come on. There we go. All right, up. All right, so here, oh, come on. Pipe heater, gas, there we go. I guess we used liquid to be safer, huh? Gold, copper, and steel. All reasonable. All right, so let's go ahead and head over this way. I'll check out my batteries. Okay, we're good. Oh, smack my head. Sun's coming up, and I'm pretty sure it's that way. So, let's head over here. Wow. Okay. Have you changed what you're selling? Oh, he has. Hello. I'll take all of that. Um... Confirm. All right, <clears throat> we gotta go. Sun's getting ready to come up. We are prepped to go. Um. Yeah, we're gonna take you and you with as well. I don't have a place to put that right yet, so we're just gonna take it with us for now. Uh, all right, we're just gonna go. Nobody saw anything. I totally did not just hit my own base. All right. So I'm pretty sure that's a satellite dish on top of that building straight ahead of us, right there. Which is why we're headed that way. And then we'll probably disassemble both of these two bases between the next couple episodes. Oh, and I did forget to put another jetpack canister on me. I forgot. So, yeah, that... Whoa. That was misleading.
I really wish there's a way to increase the render distance for the chunks. I'm not even using like 15% of my system resources. I really wish you could just crank this up and I take a smaller hit on performance or video quality or something like that to get this to really crank out. All right, so we're gonna go to this one, then that one, because that's the one I believe has a satellite dish on it. I think that's right where my cursor is, right above it now. But yeah, we're gonna tackle all of these bases over here. I wanna get as much of them recovered as possible. If this is a bug base over here, we might not spend much time at it and move over. Oh no, I said corrected, because a bug base is going to be full of iron. It's a lot of iron frames, a lot of iron plate. Which we get to turn into steel, so... But I want that other satellite dish so we can set up two merchants. That's the goal. That's been the goal for two seasons now. Come on. There you go. One more. I'm just going through it. Wow, there is not much left here. I've already gone through this pretty heavy, haven't I? Alright, we're going to skip this one. Should grab those stairs, actually. But everything is rendering out over here, so this is good. That is a broken container. That's what that is. Okay. Let's hop out. Yeah. Not a lot here. Um, can use some more rails, I guess. Get the first one opened up. Come on. All right, we have a couple few doors, so I don't think uh, that's going to be a necessity. Um, let's take this down. Oh, need a grinder havoc. Yeah, let's get this off the radar. Wrench. Okay. Okay, let's get this in here. Wrench time. Hand drill. We're just going to take this thing apart so there's nothing left for it to uh, distract us to come here again. Probar. Ugh, come on. And then we're going to head over to that one right there, right below our cursor. So that's all of those. Oh, come on. Flat wall, padded wall, padded wall. That's you guys. Plastic sheets, iron walls, geometric, and flat. Wrench. And another door. Okay, 
base is pretty much off the map now. One little piece sticking up I'm not going to worry about. Come on, turn. There we go. Well, I'm not seeing satellite dish. I just see bases that we've already looted pretty heavily. So I just need to destroy these. I'm going to park right here. Start over here on this one. Okay, let's get... Tool belt moved over here. I can't wait to get the big tool belt. That's going to be so nice. Especially when we get two of them. Because we'll be having one of them as our electrical belt. Just a bunch of cable in it all the time. Yeah, it's going to be really nice. Alright. Here... Is that it? Ooh, cladding. I'll take those, yeah, for sure. Get this mess cleaned up. Hoping someday they'll have a use for um, scrap. I mean, can't scrap down scrap. It's kind of frustrating. <laughs> Composite grading, wreckage, wreckage. Okay. So if we do this thank you can use a few of those all right so then we need our crowbar still no we need our wrench that all of them? Yeah. At least all of them we can reach, right? Okay, so you're going to go in with those. Now we're going to start taking these apart. Okay, so that's one stack. I need to get something that will modify stacks. I want everything to go to like 20 or 30. Um... Cable time. We're low on basic cable, so this is kind of nice. Not expensive to make, but just been trying to work at not crafting things and just salvaging as much as possible. So, is that all of that? I think that's all of that. Now let's grab grinder. So these steel frames are gonna be nice because we have our furnace room and our gases room, neither of which are uh, close to being ready. They need a lot of parts still. All right, so. We don't have any steel frames yet. Those were the first. Okay. 
flat wall. Uh, you're here. Here it is. All right. Uh, padded wall. Okay, and then iron walls next. Geometric goes there. All right, so and wait, hand drill deconstruct. That'll give us another plastic sheet. And that'll give us two more door kits. And one less target on our horizon. Okay. We have so much inventory. I just, why did I leave this over here? I can just pull forward now. All right. This one's a little bit more substantial. This one might take a minute. Yeah, there's a lot more to this one. Um, are you on? No, you're not. Okay. Uh, close. <laughs> Let's try that again. There we go. It's a little bit better. All right, so we already have a wrench out, so. Oh, those stack higher than, I thought those only went to 10. They go to 20, I take it. Yeah, okay. I'm a dork. I'll take it. I mean, sure. Uh, let's go to the drill. Get some more rails. Not only can we recycle a little bit of daylights out of these, but uh, we also have a lot of base to put railing up. No, no, no. I don't want the stairs yet. I want to be able to go up them. Right. So let's go ahead and put that in there. Fill that one up. I'm almost positive I've seen another um, satellite dish out here. I, I just don't remember what direction it was in. Uh, let's see here. Let's grab you. All right, so now we don't have a reason to be up here. But we can go around and collect all these up. Oh, we have the crowbar in our hand. here now I can go back to grinding and making a mess let's try to get all the windows first there we go Makes it a little bit simpler. And then all you guys go right there. More walls for our base. There we go. Padded right there. 
So next up is going to be large panels. Thank you for all the... Ah, uh, that's not the same. All right. These are. Look at all the cable. Oh. Okay, so it's all large panels. Then we have four doors left. Large panels there? No. Flat wall. That's what I was looking at. My bad. And these are all geometric thingy-mobobs. These all go to here. Let's grab a wrench. Grab some door kits. Screwdriver. Disassembles the rover. <laughs> I think I'd cry a little bit. Loot goes everywhere. All right. Um, cable cutters. Well, less items on the horizon. Are good. Because now we can know that this is not loot that we need because, well, we have all of it. We have all the loots. So. Like to get this one done so we can move to the next one. Oh, the sun's still up. Come on now. Go faster. Oh, come on. How many times do I have to pick up that one one? That one corner. All right. Whoop. Beautimus, all right, so you, whoops, meant to put that there to get those all to 50. Wrench, wrench. No? Okay. That's that. And drill. Grinder. Okay. Let's go there. That's that. Alright, so off you go. You go. No, no, no. It's not what I wanted. You go here. Thank you. All right, so jetpack. Let's take a look. I'm going to head back to that one. What is that? Okay, just a piece of ore. Okay. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to leave my crowbar in my inventory so I can flip the rover over flip the rover over if we fall into the void so supposedly if you keep spamming your crowbar when you fall into the void it will get you back out of the void or you're but most likely to don't don't get out just spam the button and you're, you'll be doing okay I thought that was a storm coming in. I was getting ready to flip out. Really 
dislike the storms. All right, so we're going to capture this whole entire thing, and uh, then we're going to head on back. Actually, I think we might head out that way instead of heading back. So let's go ahead and turn this off, and we're going to wrap up the episode here. Appreciate you guys coming out and supporting the channel. I, I'm kind of a odd one today, but we need to go get some resources. So we're going to say thank you for being here. Thank you for all the comments and thumbs ups you bring to the videos. Keep the comment or the keep the content coming. And getting it spread out to everybody else that might not know about the channel. Thanks for being here. This is Havoc. Have fun. And keep gaming.